I guess you've seen that sign enough times, haven't you? Any bar or club that sells liquor by the drink or any retail... I guess you could say Paul started it all, but it wasn't all his fault, actually. You see, he was just too good a musician for his age. He played in dance bands with older fellows, and they taught him things he'd be better off not knowing. Jim had the richest father in town, and Tip... Well, Tip was captain of the basketball team, all state the year before. They saw something funny in the way their friend Paul was acting as soon as he joined them. According to Paul, it's no fun drinking alone. He wants company. The other boys have never tasted liquor before, so they're playing with dynamite. a few tests in high school after he started drinking, but he never failed a test as serious as this one. Jim went to jail with plenty of time to think. Well, what happened to the three boys after the accident? was almost a complete alcoholic for a while, but then he became one of the youngest members of Alcoholics Anonymous, and now he has a chance to save himself. Jim never got over that accident. When he got out of jail, he went back to drinking and ended up on Skid Row, a hopeless derelict. Tip, the third boy, realized at the scene of the accident that he was playing in the wrong league. Right then, he made a vow never to touch a drop of liquor again, and he hasn't. How do I know? Because Tip is my son. Why did Americans in one year spend two billion dollars more for liquor than for all education? That's a tough one to answer. When a man can't or thinks he can't measure up, he looks for a crutch, something to help him. He takes a drink. Alcohol deadens the part of the brain that holds his worries and responsibilities, and he thinks it's helping him. But instead of helping him, every drink gives him that much less chance of ever being able to get along. And his crutch ends up by destroying him. Now, if a mature adult admits his failure as a man or woman by resorting to alcohol, 
What about the boy or girl who never gives himself a chance to learn to adjust without liquor? He's licked before he starts. So that's why you see that sign in the window, and that's why every boy and girl should be glad that somebody put it there. Because alcohol is dynamite.